All right, we are drawing a Miami Dolphins logo today, and these are not easy to do. Logos are difficult. Um, it's a lot of trying to figure out how things line up, and it's never going to be exactly the same. So we just try our best. Um, I had to draw mine a few times and make some sketches in pencil and um, make some changes before I was able to get one that I liked. So you are going to start, I like to start here with the curve for the, um, the face or the head of the dolphin. And then it curves out. And then comes back in. Okay, we're going to curve down for the flipper or the fin. And then we're going to curve back into the body. And the body is going to curve down towards the tail. Okay, the tail swoops down a little bit here. And then it comes back in. And then the other part of the tail is sticking out to the side here. Okay, so the body's going to swoop back in to the fin. And it's going to connect in towards the head. Okay, we're going to draw the eye over here. So it's just kind of like a straight line and then a curve at the top. Okay, and then we're going to draw the part that's underneath the... Um, body, the underside of the body. So we're going to, let's see, sort of follow along this same shape here, leaving a little bit of space. And then coming down and then connecting in at the fin. So we're going to double that up. And connect it and then the other fin is coming off the side there okay this part is going to connect back to the tail so we're just going to skip over the front fin and we're going to connect back into the tail and just sort of double that up because there's a, another line underneath there. Okay, and then we're going to go around for a circular sun. So right about the eye. We're going to make a circle. And then stop before we get to our dolphin. And then we're going to continue that circle underneath. Okay, then we're going to come out for the rays of the sun. So it comes out a little bit. And then we curve out and then taller. It's like taller and then shorter, taller, shorter, <coughs> going around. So the first one is short, and then you're going to curve out for a taller one, and short, and then tall, going all the way around, short, tall.
So if you made them all tall or all short, would that be a big deal? No. You'd still know it was a sun. And then the last one just connects back in. <clears throat> and then we do kind of the same thing along the bottom. Come out a little bit. And then we make a long one. And then a short one. Long one. Short one. Long one. Short one. Taller and then shorter. And then connect that back in. All right, and then you're going to color this in. If you have a turquoise, that is a nice color for the top part of the dolphin. Um, if you don't have that, you could probably just use a regular blue. Um, maybe just try to color in a little bit lighter. And so I'm going to color in this bottom portion with a regular blue. Little dot for the eye. And there's a little bit along the tail. And, or if you have like just a regular green, that would probably be fine too. I think I do have a lighter blue here that I could use for my top color. That's fine. So when I'm coloring it with markers, I try to get sort of like the inside line first and then carefully fill in my space. Helps me to stay inside my lines. And then the sun will just be colored in <coughs> with orange. So again, I can just sort of follow along that edge of shorter and taller rays coming out from the sun design. I 
and then I can fill in the rest of it more quickly. All right, and good luck with yours.